Hi guys, welcome back for some more Animal Crossing New Horizons. As you know, last week Angus moved out. Um, and because of the allergy issues and my coughing and all of that, I really wasn't able to record anything over the weekend, so I'm sorry. <laughs> um, it's been a little bit since I've put up any new content. Um, we do have a new villager. I let it autofill. I have met the villager briefly while they were in boxes. So hopefully we can all go see the interior of the house for the first time together. Good morning, Isabel. Okay, great. Sahara's here. Thank you. I don't really have a whole lot planned for this video. <laughs> I'm not even sure how long it's going to be. I am still struggling. I, you know, I've switched my allergy medications and I'm just still not really feeling myself and I'm coughing a lot. So we'll see. So we'll just see what's happening. Oh, and I've been replacing some of the trees around my island. Like I had the cypress trees here, but because cherry blossom season is starting pretty soon. I thought it would be really pretty to have just some of the regular trees so they'll turn hopefully a pretty pink. Right. I don't think I ordered much. Just maybe a whoopee cushion. Yeah. Oh, and the I forgot I got a mini car. Oh, what did Wendy have to say? Oh, yeah. I don't want to hear about you horking in a car while reading. Oh, that's so funny, though. So, yeah, I think now I have... I don't know how many colors the whoopee cushions come in. I have yellow, red, and now green. I'll show you some changes. I bought a mini car even though I have it, but it's the first time I saw it for sale in my nooks. Um, I'll keep my little red stripey dress on. It's cute. Hi, Sahara. I'll talk with you later. I added some stairs here and then also going up to Rhonda's area there. And I wanted an area where I could start putting things like the um, bonsai tree bench and other little planting things. So I just kind of did this little spot behind my house. I don't know that it's done. There's definitely room for improvement. But it's a start. I think it's kind of cute. Finally got a Mr. Rossetti out. Uh, let's check shopping while I'm thinking of it, though. Have that. Okay, yeah. I think that's only the three colors then. Yellow, red, and green. Oh my goodness, my dogs are noisy. Let's go over here. Here's the exterior of our new villager. I like it, but I kind of really liked the orange of Angus's house, so I may change this back or just change the colors a little bit. Let's go say hi, and you can see who our new friend is. Sadly, we no longer have a Cranky, though, and I really like the Crankies. Yep, hello, Jacques. Interesting. I wondered what his interior was going to look like. Oh, that's pretty cool. I like it. I have a feeling he will be fun to do a vacation home for. Let's say hi. Yeah, you made it. I want to chat. Uh, it's only Tuesday. We've got a long way until the weekend, or as I like to call it, the weeks after party. Just remember, though, if you're feeling worn out, treat yourself to a little something special. You don't have to wait for the weekend to crank the big band and eat peach crisp. <laughs> That's cute. So we have Jacques. He's very cute. I actually took a screenshot. Hold on. Um, because he came... From another island. I don't know how to pronounce it. Vallea? So I'm not sure. I have to post this on Facebook. He must... I'm guessing when I used the turnip exchange, which was like quite a while ago, though, to sell turnips. Um, or for to have people come sell turnips here. Must have been somebody who used the turnip exchange. But if that's your Jacques, I have him. He has a home here. Not sure... <laughs> How long I want to keep him? I already have Pietro as my smug. I don't need two, two, two smugs. I need a cranky. But I also have two lazies. But it's harder to get rid of the lazies. They're so cute. But yeah, his house is cute. It's pretty cool on the inside. We may, we'll just leave it alone for now. 
may fiddle with exterior colors later. <laughs> I don't really have anything else to show you guys. Oh, I guess I have a couple areas I was working on. I want to see if anybody's cooking or crafting, and Ala is. I do like her house. I just want a belly full of what you're making. Smells good. Cherry jam, yum. I might know how to make that, but I don't know. You never remember. Yep. <laughs> Thank you, Paula. She's cute. I still miss Kat, though. She was my sisterly on my old island, and I adored her. Uh, let's see if Dry goes out. Yeah, hi, bud. Yay, Wonder Bud. I was just thinking about how I wanted to see you. Oh, no, don't eat too much spice cake. I used to be stronger. I gotta try harder next time. Oh, he's funny. Oh, spice cake sounds good. Okay. I love it when that works out. I talk to my villagers anyway, but it's nice to get some miles. Slowly creeping back up there in the nook miles. So I'll work on this stuff later. Yeah, I didn't play a whole lot over the weekend, and I actually played a little Rune, Rune Factory 5. Um, I decided not to record that <laughs> because I wasn't sure how much interest there was. This is another little area I just set up here. I wanted a place to put the uh, lily pad table with the froggy chairs. It's kind of cute. Um, I'll probably put some benches and stuff along. And I recreated this little area. I had something very... Well, okay. This, I don't know what happened. I was diving for sea creatures, and I got like three of these. No, yeah. I got four overall. One for the museum. I've got one over by my pier. And I didn't want to get rid of these guys. I don't know, maybe I'll sell them, but so for now they're just living here because I needed something in that spot. But then I also recreated, I had a little spot just like this on my old island, and I liked it. Nothing super creative or fancy, but just a nice spot to sit, play guitar, and have some s'mores. <laughs> and maybe I'll think of something better later on, I don't know. And I don't have anything. I just want to see if my tree's growing that I planted. It is. Okay. So I figure even though I don't have anything cute or fancy or fun over here, at least I can have some nice, pretty pink cherry blossom trees. I'm looking for my message in the bottle, too. So I don't think I've done anything else, really, except, yeah, I moved some flowers over here. I thought it'd be kind of pretty. Got a bug catching stump. Might move this tree over a bit. I don't know. And the, yeah, anywhere you see a little tree growing, it's where it's just because I wanted, instead of fruit trees, cherry blossoms. Uh, I'm waiting still for C, uh, not CJ Flick to show up so I can get it. Let me see how many butterflies, if I have a whole lot in my storage. I want to replace the gyroids with butterflies. Maybe the fossils as well. But I'm kind of waiting till I have all of them. <laughs> oh, I don't even remember what category they're under. Probably miscellaneous. I have, might have a couple of the real... No, I put the real big ones out already by the museum. Oh, I have to find a home for my flamingos. Seems wrong to not have my flamingos out. Oh, we could put that out by the beach. Yeah, I do have a Grand Bee Dragonfly. It's just, it's so huge. <laughs> I don't know where to put that yet. <clears throat> you know I have some smaller models. I'm not sure how many. Yeah, I forgot I brought whoopee cushions with me. From my old island, too. I did put one out. There's a little tree near my house Rhonda likes to sit under, so I'm hoping to catch her sitting under it. I don't remember what butterflies I had made, so I can't remember who, what um, letter of the alphabet they start with. Ay, ay, ay. We should be getting close. Okay. 
Yeah, I only have a paper kite butterfly so far. I want to wait till I have more. Sorry. Sorry to make you look through my, my storage. Let's see what we have for sale in Nook's Cranny. This is just kind of a... Barton around the island video, I guess. Because I can't really... I'm still very fuzzy-headed, you guys. I've not had Claritin D take this long before to kind of work it, get my, my system, get used to it. Whatever. Words. Words are tricky. We have the tractor. We have all of these goodies, I think. What are our turnip prices? Eee, horrible. See you later. I don't know if I have the magic kit, but I also don't really need the magic kit. I probably have it. Yeah, I just feel like I'm in that waiting period. We're going to have cherry blossom season pretty soon. I think the 1st through the 10th. And then bunny days a little bit later this year. I think that starts on the 10th. Hi, Horns B. I'm trying to talk to you. <laughs> oh, God, I forgot I changed that to his greeting. Oh, no. What's up, chicken butt? I was just thinking about how I wanted to see you. Yeah, so was Drago. Everything tastes great. Oh, you're so cute, Drago. Let's see what Sahara has for sale. In the most laggiest part of my island. Ooh, that's a lot of noises. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's get all of the rugs. <laughs> the little whistling gyroid is so cute. I can't see it, but I can hear it. I don't have a whole lot of rugs, so it's good she's here. I do go check, excuse me, go and check her every week on Harv's Island, but eh. it's kind of more fun buying them when you don't know what you're getting. I don't know why. <laughs> the gyrate's cracking me up, you guys. <laughs> So are any of you playing Rune Factory 5? I've only played a little bit of it, but so far I'm liking it. I've never um, played any of their games before. That's about all I did this weekend. I sat on the sofa with my dogs, <laughs> feeling very just out of it, <laughs> and binge watched a lot of TV and played some Animal Crossing and some Rune Crafting. And it was a nice weekend. I didn't have to cook or anything. Uh, yeah. We'll go for a wallpaper. Because that's more important to me than flooring. <laughs> oh no, we're gonna buy more. We're on a spree, a shopping spree. So chatty. And I'm not gonna read all of that. I gotta save my voice. Mm -hmm. I wanna take a moment though to thank all of you who still subscribed, even though I haven't put out any videos since like Thursday or Friday. Um, we've had a few more subscribers, and you guys, a lot of you, we've had a couple hundred views, which is a lot for my channel of my uh, video of, um, okay, we'll go, well, of my video of Angus leaving Scramble Crosswalk. I oh, I know that. Palace Wall. Oh, let's go look at what these things look like in our house. So it's had quite a few views and I've been getting a lot of likes on some of my older videos and stuff. So thank you for, you know, watching and, and hitting the like button and subscribing. It's really meaning a lot to me and it just made my heart happy when I was having just kind of a rough and down few days. <laughs> I'm sorry, the whoopee cushion will always make me laugh. <laughs> Oh no, I can't laugh, I'll start coughing. 
But yes, the 12 year old in me will always appreciate a good whoopee cushion. Let's go down into the basement. Um, we'll try out the, excuse me, the wallpaper and flooring in there. Yeah, I started working on this room and I'm just, it's not moxie. It's cute and pretty, but you know what? We're, no, 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 keep playing. I wanted to uh, get rid of the stuff that's in here. I'm going to change it, make it into a fun room, a gaming room or something. Uh, storm. <laughs> there we go. At least I have these things crafted, so I need them. I've got them. Okay, so we have rock climbing wall. Oh, that's kind of fun. This could be fun for Dom's house, you guys. And then the palace wall. That's quite fancy. Let's uh, put that back <laughs> for now. We'll put these in uh, storage. What's the... Uh... Yeah, I remember that that's what that... That's kind of neat. Huh. I did just buy that car. Okay, so I have had a funny idea. I'm not going to do it today. And the only thing is, it's only going to be funny for me because you guys won't get to see the whole outcome of it. But my husband isn't playing. And, um... So, like, on festival day... Well, that's cute. I like the color. I went to his island and he was home and I said, I'm going to do the festival event for you because you're not doing it and I want to get you the items. Oh, that is a rough rug. And so I did that and then he doesn't know it because he was sitting in the same room while I did this, but he wasn't paying any attention to what I was doing on his island. I took all of the festival items and put them all in one of the rooms of his house. So now I'm thinking it would be funny to do that for every in-game event. For most of them. Like get the whole Christmas set, give them a Christmas room. Uh, with Bunny Day coming up, we'll do a Bunny Day room. And I find it hilarious and it will give me much, much pleasure. But the problem is, I don't know when he will ever play again. So I won't be able to record his reaction or anything either for you guys. But I might bring you along on the ride while I do it anyway. Because why not? <laughs> it's just fun and silly. And I might leave his main room alone so he like doesn't even know anything is amiss. <laughs> and then all of a sudden he goes into the back room. Bam! Bunny day right in your face. Or, you know, Christmas. Or... I don't know. And that crosswalk made me think that would be kind of fun to like set up a little car accident like I did on one of those vacation homes. Like go and just put that down in one of the rooms and get a truck and the mini car. <laughs> and the uh, uh, CPR mannequin, I forget the re resuscitate mannequin or whatever it's called. Photos are very pink. I really haven't had a good a selection of clothes lately. That's sweet. Roomba. Rumba. Roomba. Yeah, room. Oh my god. Do the rum. Is it Rumba or room? That damn vacuum has ruined it for me. The rumba. You dance the rumba? It's rumba, not rumba. Oh my lord, you guys, I'm so out of it. This is why I haven't been doing any videos. This is just going to be me rambling. But fortunately not for much longer. We'll make this one really short today. Nothing good for sale. Nope, Mabel, nothing caught my eye today. Thank you. I should look to see if I missed out on any bamboo recipes. I don't know if bamboo season's over or not. So, I really don't think there's a whole lot more to do. I haven't been doing the money trees. I'm just digging them up and covering it over. I don't... I, I'm not, I mean, I like, I like making the money, but I'm not necessarily a big fan of the way they look. Oh, I took out that little inner tube, and I, yeah. 
Oh, I put the wrong thing back. <laughs> I put my storage shed back. That's okay. Let's run to my beach. Oh, lag. Um, I put just a couple of like beach chairs out just to fill a space. Oh yeah, that's another thing I did. I got rid of all of my extra flowers. They are all on my husband's beach now. <laughs> This looks plain. I've got to do something else for it. I don't know what yet. I just wanted to put something here because it was naked. <laughs> we had a naked spot. No, don't lie down. Just push it. Push it real good. <laughs> okay. A little. At least one of my villagers might come sit on it. Let's move it just a little. I don't think we could push it any farther. No. That's kind of cute. So we'll start working on this little beach spot. Um, yeah. Dom's not at home. I may do that later this week. Um. We'll keep, maybe keep his little backyard area with his hay bed and his little outdoor, or his brick oven. And then we'll do the rock climbing wall. That would be kind of fun. Maybe some workout equipment. And I also need to redo uh, Pietro's house. I am not happy with it at all. He's not home right now either. There's my bud. Mi amigo, bonjour! <laughs> What's the latest, bud? I'm just making it up as I go along, but I know one thing for sure. Moving to Turtle Time was the best decision I ever made because you live here. Oh, thank you, buddy. He's so sweet. I loves him. Not having luck fighting my message in the bottle, but to be honest, I'm also not really looking all that hard. So you guys, I think this is just going to be really short. I just wanted you to meet our newest villager. Just show you kind of what's been going on around the island a bit. Yeah, still not super happy with this area. But I don't know what else to do with it. If you have any ideas, I'd love to hear them. Uh, so anyway, I will try to get some more content made this week. It it just depends on how my allergies and my cough are doing uh, and how fuzzy headed I feel because I am just feeling really slow and tired and fuzzy and just not normal. <laughs> it should this usually when I switch medicines like this, it usually takes me a good two weeks to feel like myself again. So we're halfway there. <laughs> so thank you for your patience and thank you again so much for watching and subscribing. It's really, you know, meant so much to me. So anyway, you guys take care.